All right, Shalom, I want to first start off giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak Radash. Double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone, and peace and blessings unto the elect of the nation of Israel. This is the brother Abadia from the GMS Houston camp, and I'm here with a quick hit. I got one scripture for you, and it's out the book of 2 Corinthians, the first chapter, and the fifth verse. And Lord willing, you know, this is edifying. It says, for as the sufferings of Mashiach abound in us, what is the first part of this verse saying? It's saying that for us believing in this truth, believing in Yahweh Shai, because really Yahweh Shai is the truth. Don't, don't the scriptures say that he comes in the volume of the book, according to Psalms 40 and 7, it's written of him. Okay? So being in this truth, the, we're going to catch a, uh, an abundance of suffering. Let's look this word abound up real quick before we read the, the rest of this verse. Strong's G, 4052. Perisuo. Perisuo. All right, so we go down to the definitions. It says to exceed a fixed number or measure. So, you know, being in this truth, we're going to catch above, way above average type of uh, uh, trials and tribulations. It says to be left over above a certain number of, or measure to be over to remain to exist or to be at hand in abundance to be great abundant um and you know we can keep going down this uh they are pretty all these uh definitions are synonymous with each other obviously they they go hand in hand it says overflow to excel yeah it says to furnish one richly so that he has abundance to make abundant or excellent so when it comes to us suffering by believing in Yahweh Shai, we're gonna catch that by the by the ton, by the by by or in abundance. All right, let's go back to the verse. It says, So our consolation also abounded by my Shayak. There's the balance to it. Because we can't just be in this truth and just everything is just catching hell, 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 hell going through all these different you know trials and tribulations it has to the most high is about balance so he balancing balances it out by giving us comfort you know while we walk in 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 this you know in this flesh in this wicked world suffering okay let's go into the word consolation Strong's G, 3874. Paraclesis. Paraclesis. All right, it says, A calling near, summons, importation, supplication, entreaty, exhortation, admonish, uh, ad, oh, admin, admin, yeah, ad, admonition. It says, encouragement, consolation, comfort. Now, if you go actually look up the etymology of the word consolation, it goes back to comfort. Let's read on a little more. It says, uh, solace, that which affords comfort or refreshment. All right. Uh, it says, thus of the Messianic salvation, so the ra rabbis called the Messiah the consoler or the comforter. See? So... We're going to catch an abundance of hell at the same time to balance it out. We're going to catch or we're going to receive an abundance of comfort through understand having the understanding, you know, having the uh, the faith in, in the scriptures. Also having the, the you know, the brotherhood. Having a prayer, you know, the ability to have the 
the uh, or the, really the blessing to have the names of Yahweh and Yahweh Shai so that we can pray, okay, for strength, for, for whatever we need, you know, on a spiritual note. So we're going to catch here, but we also comforted, you know, or consoled in this, in this truth. And it's all by the, it's all by Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai. And really by Yahweh, you know, the Most High giving us Yahweh Shai. You know? So Lord willing, this video was edifying until the next one, Shalom.